Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to create Salesforce Einstein bot contacts to variables and also display its value in the bot builder in the di uh, uh, using the dialog and also how to make it work in the rule action. For this uh, video demo, I'm going to make use of WhatsApp messaging channel. Since I'm going to use, use a WhatsApp channel, it will create messaging session record. In the messaging session record, I'm going to make use of channel name and channel type in the context variables. This is my WhatsApp bot. I'm going to make use of channel name. Connection is WhatsApp, field is uh, channel name, and the field API name is messaging session dot channel name. I created another variable for channel type. Let's see how to create this uh, context variables. First, we have to retrieve the bot. Once we retrieve the bot, we will have the version meta file and also the real uh, original WhatsApp uh, b uh, bot uh, meta file. In the bot meta file, you will have the context variables that comes uh, uh, out of the box when the Einstein bot is developed. Using that, you can also create your own context variables. So here I created two context variables. One for uh, channel name and the other one is for channel type. So similarly, uh, we can also create it here. Once you uh, create this uh, XML uh, format, it, it should be within the bot uh, tag um, you can, you know, and uh, you can uh, place it around the same place where the other uh, context variables are there. Um, in the, the field name is uh, very important. This is what will get the value. So here I'm using messaging session dot channel name and here I'm using messaging session dot channel type. You can uh, deploy this. Once you deploy this, you should be able to see those variables. Okay. Next, in the dialog, in the welcome menu, I have Hi, I am a WhatsApp bot, a digital assistant. Please choose your option. Um, and uh, next, I am printing the channel name. In order to display the context variable value, we have to use dollar symbol context dot channel name. If we directly put the channel name here, it won't display. Uh, similarly, for channel type also, since it is a context variable, I'm using dollar symbol context dot channel type. In the rule action, we can directly make use of context variable channel type, whether its value is equal to WhatsApp. If it is WhatsApp, I am sending I am sending a message saying that welcome to support via WhatsApp. And then it will display whether to close uh, the case or to transfer the uh, transfer it to the agent. Let's test this. So I sent a message. Now the welcome dialog will be invoked. The context variables would have been uh, uh, declared and it would have populated the values now. Channel type is WhatsApp. Channel name is WhatsApp channel. And uh, since it is uh, channel type is equal to WhatsApp, the rule action got triggered and then the message welcome to support via WhatsApp is sent. Please check the video description. In the video description, I have shared my blog post. From the blog post, you should be able to get the sample code for creating uh, the context variables. I hope it was helpful.
थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग